to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. It's an NBA Monday night brought to you by ESPN on EA Sports as we get set for the fifth meeting of the season between the Philadelphia 76ers and the Chicago Bulls. Here we go. it out to the corner. Oh, excellent screen. To the basket, and the rebound grabbed by Lopez. Lopez gets it up for two. He sinks it. Nice entry pass there to set it up. is broken up, stolen by Lopez. Nine left on the shot clock. Bell's trying to establish some low post position. Shut down, forced to make the pass. Takes another shot. Lopez is shot for two, misses. Great look. Simmons. Just on the way to the rim. Rebound snatched by Lopez. Markinen. Shot clock down to 12 seconds remaining. Down into the lane. Straight to the basket. To Reddick, fires away from downtown. And J.J. Reddick with the jumper for three. The transition three-point jump shot is one of the hardest to defend in the NBA because transition defenses have been taught to protect the paint first. You might ask, why are you settling for a three? It's not a settle. That's a great look for him. He's a knockdown three-point shooter. The length of the floor, he puts it up. Misses at the other end. He wanted a foul there. Getting the ball to the rim is so important to winning basketball. Great offense, great look. Just couldn't knock it in. We're down to nine seconds on the shot clock. Moves around the defender. Throws it down in his face with authority. There was no one who was going to stand in his way. The explosion, the athleticism, and the dunk. I got some points. Looks to the post. At the rim, Freddie bank shot on the adjustment. That's really good body control and a great finish in the paint. Still plenty of time, 12 seconds on the shot clock, taking it baseline to Levine. Time is not on their side. What will they do? That one halfway down before popping out. That solid defense as the shot clock was winding down to contest the shot. And now he moves around the defender. Gets the two. Lucky roll. J.J. Redick with five points. Typically, that's not the shot you want the contested two. It worked out this time. Oh, quick move, gets inside. Can't get it to go from close range. Guy goes up in the paint, you have to contest it and make them miss. 
Quick move to get inside. Strong rebound for another possession. Throws it down through the traffic. I want to see that one again. That's a sweet move in driving dunk. Green set nicely. He slams it right in his face. And the whistle. A foul called on the tremendous dunk at the rim. What a play. That's highlight reel material right there. A nasty dunk and a possible three-point play. That is strength personified. I got you right here. Box that. Box that. Completes the three-point play. I got him, I got him. To Embiid. You don't want it, you don't want it. For two, marketing the rebound. Help defense there with the switch. Curling in, Bell shot blocked. Oh, he threw it out of bounds. The Bulls get to inbound. Levine choosing the screen, looking to get free. Not a lot of time for a shot opportunity. Oh, what a great dunk. That's a poster right there. What a hammer dunk. I got him. I got ball. I got ball. Here's the screen. Goes to the goal. Philadelphia is shooting 77% on the season. He's fouled. And he connects on the first free throw. We're down to 11 seconds on the shot clock. Oh, sloppy with the ball there. Oh, no! He just crushed the defender with the slam. And there's no doubt we'll be seeing that one on SportsCenter. Sweet dish. Puts it down. Read the defense. They'll tell you what to do. They get up above you on the screen and roll. You slip to the rim. Then it's easy. Good pass, solid catch, and finish at the basket. Perfect entry pass. Swarming defense, and he finishes at the rim. They're in a rhythm, guarding the pick and roll. They don't expect you to hit them with a slip. You slip to the rim. You get the fine pass on the run, catch and finish. Bell's working hard, backing down his opponent. A ferocious slam. That's just a very poor job of communicating there. Switching when you didn't have to, leading to the mismatch and ultimately to the dunk. <laughs> to Embiid. Sloppy play. Fires yet again. He rattles it in. Just another example of good defense instigating good offensive opportunities. Here, a nice two-point shot in transition. Into the paint, to the rim. And he'll head to the line again and shoot two. There's the whistle. Nice job drawing the foul. Robin Lopez picks up his first of the night. Good post-up move. Attacking the defender by backing him down and drawing the foul. Oops, missed the first one. Good 
bounce back, hitting the second free throw. He's one for two. Lopez is looking to get free off the screen. Nice adjustment. Unable to flip it in. You contest, they miss. You don't, they score. It's really that simple. He's blocked. No doubt about that one. That's an offensive foul called against the Bulls. The 76ers get the inbound. Oh, excellent screen. To the rim. Fultz is unable to bank that one in. You got to finish with strength in the paint. You can't go up weak like that. He just grabs the ball out of the air. A great defensive play. Throws it down. What a play. You've got to keep pushing and probing. Set a tone in the first half. We're going to run it, and we're going to attack the basket in transition. He saw the opening, he took advantage of it, and he made the finish at the basket. Bell for two. And he gets to go back to the free throw line. A couple of more free throws, and a foul is called. Good offense is about getting your best players their best shots in their best spot. Here, an aggressive move. You're a great free throw shooter. Earn your way to the free throw line. Take the contact, take the foul, work your way there, and knock them in. And gets both points from the line. Curls in, off the screen, pulls up and shoots. To the basket, flips it up. And he's rewarded for his hustle. Gets the basket to go. Hey, kids at home, you need to study this man's body control and poise as he finished that shot in the paint. Grant. Nine left on the shot clock. Soft touch gets the roll. He's got 13 points thus far. move into the paint. Puts it up for two. Quick rebound by Allen. Eleven seconds now on the shot clock. Grant from beyond the arc. Drains the three off the quick release. Nice quick decision right there. Three points straight on. to Fultz, gets inside, puts it up, gets to the rim, and it rolls in. It's hard to guard NBA-level athletes who can also handle the ball. Here, using his dribble drive opportunity, gets in the paint and finishes right at the rim with strength. Screen set nicely. and gets it to go. And we have a timeout here in the late stages of the first quarter. Excellent job of getting into the paint and finishing at the rim. And we have both teams with substitutions here. Nice work getting into the paint to finish. To Johnson. Nice inside pass. They're going to have to be quick here. Takes a shot to the head. That wasn't intentional. 
Grant, Portis trying for position in the paint. Oh, what a move, and down goes the defender. He says no, but the ref says foul, called against Johnson. And he will go to the line for some free throws. Can't connect on the first free throw. is the boat. The shot clock shows 10 seconds left. It's a loose ball. Almost a costly turnover. Nearly picked off. Shot clock down to two. That's from downtown. And he curls in. Ball comes loose. He loses control of it, and the ball is stolen. In the paint, Fultz the rebound. Good solid entry pass. Let's it go for two. Puts it in. It'll count if it goes. And there's the buzzer. First quarter comes to an end. The 76ers up by two. We'll be right back with more Monday Night Basketball here on ESPN after the break. Second quarter is set to begin. Some impressive shooting numbers. Jeff, is it good offense or bad defense? Both. The offense is superior right now, Mike. The shot making, the passing, the ball movement. But the defense, my goodness, was it bad. You've got to close out harder than that and take away the open shot. Oh, in and out. Gets in the paint for the layup. It's good. And one. Now it's time to go to the line for that three-point play opportunity. I love it when I see a guy concentrate through contact. He did, getting the ball in the basket and drawing the foul. It's a three-point play. I got ball. I got ball. Oh, excellent screen. To Embiid, backing his man down. Embiid for two, shoots away. That shot won't go. Tremendous job making it difficult to get to the basket. To Allen. Trying to work it down low. Marking it for two, puts it up, nails it. And it's a three-point lead for Chicago. The screen is set, looking to curl in. 11 seconds remaining on the 24. Embiid, Embiid 
misses another one. It's hard to close out on great shooters. Tremendous job right there, getting his hand up, mirroring the ball. Taken away by Embiid. One of the keys to winning in this league is not beating yourself. Both teams seem determined to beat themselves rather than their opponents. And the defense switches. Gets to the rim. Time now for a pair of free throws. Good work to draw the foul. Excellent offensive play right there. Contact, finish, just didn't get it to drop for the three-point play opportunity. First free throw, perfect. Good free throw shooting, knocks down a pair. Two minutes gone by in the second. The Sixers down by three. He curls. Strong at the rim. High basketball IQ play here. Reads the defense, sees that his man is above the screener. Good slip, good catch, good finish. We're down to 11 seconds on the shot clock. Oops, gets hit in the head with that pass. Pass to the corner. Embiid's looking to post up. Covington from downtown, no one near him. That's a three. Philadelphia's three for three from three-point territory. This is the type of action we've grown accustomed to in the NBA. This back and forth where the lead change often throughout the game. This is exactly the type of exhilarating basketball that I would pay to see. To Markinen. He shoots. Doesn't get the roll. Embiid. Shot clock says 12. Looking for low post position. Embiid fires away for two. Able to put it in. He's shooting 62% from the field here tonight. And there's a timeout call. for some lineup changes now from both clubs. Lopez is looking to set up in the paint. To the rim, puts it in on a straight drive down the middle. You need guys who can beat their man off the dribble and finish at the basket. Sweet entry pass. Embiid's working down low in the post. Embiid for two. And Joel Embiid with a nice look, sinks it. And I think you have to see a defense adjustment here soon. He's just making it look so easy early in this matchup. Who says it's not a contact sport? What a screen. To the rim, off the dribble. Can't connect from close range. Embiid's trying for low post position. Embiid for two, lets it go. Hits the shot. He's 7 for 10 from the field. Portis. The shot clock down at 12 seconds remaining.
Good setup with the entry pass. To the basket, sweep off the glass. That's nice body control right there on that layup. Good finish. Into the front court, desperate for some points. A pretty entry pass. At the rim, gets the two. Lucky roll. You can't teach this balance, this coordination, and this dexterity around the basket. Good post move, backing him down, and then using his body to create space and finish at the rim. To Embiid. Eight seconds remaining on the shot clock. Looking to dominate down low. Just gets it off in time. Nails the three. When everybody is involved in touching the ball, like what's happening here in the first half, and you've got your assist total up, then you're going to create also a defensive intensity at the other end of the floor. And that's exactly what has happened here in the first half. Can hold on to the ball. Driving baseline, adjusting on the shot, misses at the rim. Time and again, they've showed a commitment to contest shots in the paint. Nothing easy. Portis. Still plenty of time, 12 seconds on the shot clock. Here's the pick, moves around the defender. Oh, nice block. They got him, foul. Oh, that's a close call that goes against the defender, but a terrific effort trying to slide over and take the charge. The Bulls get the inbound in here. Screen set nicely. It's a loose ball. Oh, great hustle as he looks for the save. Bad pass, tipped out of bounds, but it'll be Bulls ball. Jeff, we've been treated to some terrific action so far in this game. And what you're seeing here is both teams being very unselfish with the basketball. The assist total in this game is right, remarkable right, right. for both teams. Down into the lane, goes to the goal. Not able to hit on that adjustment. Driving the ball into the paint is the most important offensive tool in the game. He had a great look. Pass easily picked off. This is an absolute joke, the way both of these teams are turning the ball over. It's hard to fathom how they let this game get so out of hand. Oh, nice pull-up jumper. Getting it done on the offensive glass. He's got five rebounds in this game. To Markinen, Bell's trying to get free off the pick. And he kicks it out. Wide open for three. Knocks it down. Chicago's shooting 66% from downtown tonight. I got I got ball. Listen, I got Mike, ball. they didn't have a lot of assists in the last game, and sometimes we can say, well, they didn't pass the ball. Sometimes you have to make shots. You could be passing the ball well, and you miss the shot. Well, today they're passing the ball well, and they're making. That's why their assists are way up. They work it around the perimeter. Right, right, right. And now he moves around the defender. Bells denied. He rattles it in. <laughs> to the rim. It's good. He's shooting 75% from the field tonight. Strong move off the dribble penetration to finish at the rim. To Lopez. There's the switch. Shoots the three. Bang! You can tell both of these teams are completely unselfish with the basketball. Look at the assist total, and you can tell that both teams have learned very well that Sherry gets it to go and the foul. Robin Lopez picks up his second of the night. That's big time play right there. Finishing the shot through the contact and now goes to the free throw line.
unable to connect on the free throw. Entry pass gets it inside. The Justs, Levine's bank shot won't go. And you gotta finish strong on those shots. You're right at the basket, you gotta put the ball in the hole. In and out. It's really hard to contain dribble penetration in transition. Here, an outstanding example of transition defense, keeping the ball out of the paint and forcing a contested two-point jump shot. Ball comes loose. Oh, and he throws it away. Well, up to this point, Jeff, we've been seeing plenty of positives from both of these teams. And this first half has been all about these two teams' incredible offensive displays. Possession after possession, these teams keep finding ways to score. The Bulls get to inbound. Oh, excellent screen. Forced to make the pass. Hey, back door, back door. Watch that back door. Lopez fires with two on the clock from downtown. Simmons hoping for position in the paint. Throws it down. That's a poster right there. What a hammer dunk. Boy, they need to get something going here. Eleven seconds now on the shot clock. Back out to the perimeter for three. The wide open shot. In and out. The Bulls a perfect example of you're gonna have your ups and downs night in and night out offensively. But if you play defense with that type of commitment, with that type of passion, you're in every game. Absolutely. The misnomer is that defense wins championships, but when you're going through and absorbing the injuries the Bulls have had the last couple of years, you have to try to stay in games by playing tough as nails defense, and that's exactly the formula the Bulls used to play with great, great success. Bell fires, soft touch, gets the roll. Curling in, Fultz is turned away. What a block. Ball goes out of bounds. And Brett Brown makes a substitution, switching up one of his players. The Sixers get the inbound. And Bede. 11 seconds remaining on the 24. Nails it. It's a double-digit lead. That's a 10-2 run for the 76ers. Blows past the defender. Comes off the screen to the basket, banks it in. That's how you win in this league, repeating the same thing over and over again. If there's penetration, step over, defend it well, make them take and make a tough shot. That's what happened here, but good, solid defense. It's a piece of it. Well, he loses it, comes up with a pretty steal. Oh, quick move, gets inside. The Sixers with the offensive rebound for a second chance opportunity. The left hander off the backboard. Chicago's down big in this first half. At the buzzer. Oh, it's good. Buzzer sounds, and the first half comes to an end. Philadelphia is up by nine. Let's see what's on Jalen Rose's mind right now.
time for the Rose Report at halftime, and it's brought to you by EA Sports. The 76ers have the lead, but not by much. Clearly, the number of three-pointers these guys scored in the first half was incredible. And if they can keep that up, it's going to be tough to keep that team down. Have a look at the leading scores for the Philadelphia 76ers. The Bulls have kept it close after one half. And without question, they can put themselves in a position to win this game if they continue to rack up the assists. These are the guys getting buckets for the Chicago Bulls. Game track. Steals. Some very aggressive defense has allowed both teams to rack up a lot of steals. Ball security will be the key in the upcoming half, especially for the weakest dribbler. You know who you are. Here's a look at the first half stats. Player of the half. Joel Embiid has been making the competition look silly on the defensive end. And here we've got the stats for you. Top play, and we've got three of them for you. Number two. Number one. All right, back to the second half. I'll see you after the game. To Markinen. Lopez is looking for position in the paint. Tied up, has to make that pass. Covington, the rebound. He's running the entire floor. Oh, that's a get out of my way. I'm throwing it down. Poster! Oh, my goodness. What a dunk. It's a loose ball, and they come up with the turnover. To the basket, flips it up, and he'll head to the line for the third time tonight. And he draws the foul. Smart basketball, preventing an easy score and putting a poor free throw shooter to the free throw line. First free throw, good. The 76ers, oh, excellent timing, comes up with the ball on the rebound and lays it back up and in. See, this is why this team loses games. They take possessions off. Giving up a free throw rebound and a basket is inexcusable. Weaves his way to the basket. Levine's bank shot, no good. Getting the ball to the rim is so important to winning basketball. Great offense, great look, just couldn't knock it in. Fires again. Ooh, misses the inside shot. To Levine. There's the double team. Levine. Not able to hit from beyond the line. It up. And now it's one free throw. Count it and the foul called against Lopez. Picks up his third foul. That's great body control right there. Finishes the shot and now goes to the free throw line.
marketing the rebound. Back on offense, they need to get something going. To Lopez. Let's it go. And Joel Embiid with the rebound earns himself a double double. That's become a familiar sight, watching him grab rebound after rebound. He's definitely putting in the work. Continue to work it around the perimeter. And he curls in, inside, hits for two. When you play that good a defense and you contest the two-point J, you expect a good result there. The offense was just superior. The concentration and the follow-through. He stuck his shot. Looking to curl in. To Embiid, backing his way down in the post. Not a lot of time for a shot here. Pulls up for the shot, and he nails it. A long two. To Markkinen. Screen set nicely. Passes it right back. No one near him. A wide open shot. Hits the backboard and out of play. The 76ers get the inbound in here. Chicago's now back on defense. They need a big stop to turn things around. There's the pick. Pass to the corner. We're down to 11 seconds on the shot clock. They've got to get this off in a hurry. Looks to the post. They don't beat the clock. 24 second violation. The Bulls get to inbound. All right, here we go. They'll put it in play. Oh, it's turned back by Embiid. This is one of the great defensive performances I've seen in a while. The number of shot blocks in really rain shot blocks where he's coming from a long ways away to challenge shots at the basket and right on the block tremendous effort tied up and has to pass ball comes loose it's deflected and they come up with it to Covington. Simmons looking for the screen to get himself open. Backing his man down. It's a loose ball, and it's a turnover. He curls in the paint. Chicago's shooting 75% from the line in tonight's game. Oh, he got hit, and they call it. Draws the foul, called against him B. The first free throw. Able to convert on both free throws. To MB. Trying to work it down low. Ball comes loose. Pass deflected, but they hold on. Not much time to get this shot off. And B fires away. And Robin Lopez with strong defense to alter that shot. Great contest on that shot, Mike. He had the shot timed perfectly to challenge and force the miss. Excellent screen. Simmons shot swatted away. Lopez is trying to get down low. They double him. Shut down, forced to make the pass. 
strong offensive rebound. He's averaging six boards per game this season. Embiid fires it back out to the perimeter. Quick move to get inside. Terrific rejection. Throws it down. Hey, this is why this has turned into a blowout. Poor perimeter defense. Get broken down off the dribble. No help. No basket protection. No chance of winning. The perfect dish stuffs it in the rim. And the only way to get an easier two points is to have your mom keep in score. To Covington. Denied by Lopez. It's a loose ball. Oh, that pass way off the mark. And we have a substitution being made. The Bulls get the inbound. Levine moves around the defender, and the reach in is called by the ref. Reddick's not giving his opponent room to breathe with this pressure. And what more can you say about his defensive effort here to start this game? He's doing a great job anticipating, stripping, and stealing the ball and allowing his team to get out in transition. And now he moves around the defender, throws it up from deep in the corner. Shot from downtown, no good. Keeps the play alive and scores. You're not going to see a better possession in the NBA from both sides of the ball. Good defense, good offense, good offense one out that time. Curling in, puts it up, deep corner shot. Nails it from downtown on the catch and shoot. Big time corner three right there. In a rough stretch, let's see if they can break themselves out of it right now. Lopez. Shoots it, he's off balance. And Robin Lopez with a nice shot for two. He's averaging 10 points per game this season. Reddick's using the screen, trying to get free. To the rim, nice adjustment. Just won't go for a point blank range. Good switching on defense. Levine. Final seconds counting down. Fires the three with two left on the 24. He knocks it down. Beautiful feed for the assist. Simmons. Forced to make the pass. Gets it down low. Looking for low post position. And B for two. Oh, he's got the hot hand. Screen set nicely. Levine. Shot clock says 12, goes to the point, count it, plus the foul. Chicago's eight for 10 from the line tonight. That's great body control right there. Finishes the shot and now goes to the free throw line. Rejection goes out of bounds, so it'll be 76ers ball. 
Tony Allen subbed back onto the court. The Sixers get the inbound in here. Perfect entry pass. Looking to dominate down low. Fires for two. Gets it to go. He's shooting 63% from the field. Ball loose again. Oh, he gets the steal. Curls in. To Embiid. Looks to put it back up again. Can't connect. I think the big minutes are wearing him down. To Lopez. Backing his way down in the post. Ball comes loose. a devastating dunk in his face. That was a great dunk right there, Mike. Man, he really threw it down hard. To Allen. The shot clock down at 12 seconds remaining. Lopez is working hard, trying to back down his opponent. Lopez for two, shoots away. Oh, excellent screen. 11 seconds now on the shot clock. And he curls in. And B misfires again. Nice inside pass. Lopez for two. Puts it up. Oh, pretty pass and an easy two. Looking to curl in. Looks to the post. You're going to have to be quick with this shot. Oh, he shoots it. Can't get it to go from close range. Portis. Loses the control. There's a steal. Thirty seconds to go here in the third quarter. The Sixers up by ten. Gets it right back. Nice move into the paint. Swatted away by Embiid. Out of bounds. Ref says it'll be Bulls ball. Both coaches now feeling they need to make some changes on the floor. The Bulls get to inbound. From deep in the corner, and Tony Allen with the jump shot. Knocks it down for three. At the buzzer. Third quarter comes to an end. Fourth quarter coming up. The 76ers up by seven. We'll have more Monday night NBA on ESPN after this break. an impressive first three quarters but a big fourth quarter coming up what's the key for them to wrap this up Jeff urgency it's got to be all about urgency to take care of business right now don't waste any possessions don't blow any sets do your job on every possession marking in jump shot misses for two this guy's a great shooter they were on him like Velcro and forced the miss good defense Covington fires away for two. Oh, scores at the rim.
to Allen. Here's the screen. What a screen. Man, that had to hurt. Out of bounds. It'll be Bulls ball. Man, what a great game thus far, Jeff. Definitely an entertaining matchup so far. And this game has just been absolutely tremendous to watch. The offensive display we're seeing here today from these squads will not soon be forgotten. Seven seconds remaining on the 24. Whatever they've got planned, it'll have to be quick. Kicks it back outside. It's good. A two-pointer. Tony Allen shooting 66% from the field. And in their last game, the assist total wasn't where it needed to be. Today, it's a completely different story. Screen set nicely. Set in for two. You need guys who can beat their man off the dribble and finish at the basket. To Markinen. Puts it up. Nice finish around the rim. To Fultz. Gets inside. Gets to the rim. Unable to bank it in. Hey, that's what you got to do late. You got to get the ball in the paint and then finish with strength. To Markinen. Turns it over. Nobody there. Looks like the coach is going to make some changes. Yep, hitting them some substitutions. The 76ers get the inbound. To Embiid. Backing his man down. Time is not on their side. What do they do? Inside to the basket, unable to flip it in. Hey, that's outstanding defense right there. A little bit of a throws it down. What separates teams in this league are teams who go on the road, find themselves in a hole, and continue to grind. Grinding teams are never out of the game. They have worked their way back into the game, and now, hey, listen, it's not enough to get close. You got to find your way over the hump. Oh, pretty move into the paint. Oh, he knocks it down. This speed is hard to guard. Speed kills. Beats his man off the dribble and then finishes right at the basket. The screen is set. He curls. Strong finish at the rim. You're not winning late in a close game playing that type of defense, allowing the ball to go in a direct line drive right at the basket. it back out. Quick release for three. Fultz's shot from downtown won't go. The success they had with their long range shooting earlier in this matchup has not happened for them in the second half. They have to figure out other ways to score the basketball than just relying on the three-point shot. Knocks down the first one. 